Good morning, everyone. What's going on? Yeah, I had to check. <clears throat> so, um, it is currently like 8, almost 9 o'clock. I have a meeting here um, with the marketing company. So, it's kind of how I get my day started. So, currently right now, this is like anywhere. That, that's what, what I love about working remote is anywhere is my workspace. But currently here, um, I, I work here outside in the living room on the couch, but in like the next week, um, I'm so excited. I will have my own office. Um, I have a standing desk. Oh, well, anyways, I'll, I'll show you, but yeah. Um, currently getting some, doing some follow-ups with uh, my team. Currently I'm doing some follow-ups with the team, kind of going over some some tasks um, at hand. Uh, we have a few things that we need to get accomplished this week. Um, then after that, what I'll probably do is make breakfast. Usually this meeting takes a little over an hour or about an hour, give or take, um, since it is near the end of the week usually. So I have two meetings, um, one on Tuesday and then one on Thursday. Usually the one on Thursday is a little bit shorter just because it's near the end of the week. Um, we do a lot of our heavy lifting in the beginning of the week and then after that we um, I wouldn't say chill because we always stay proactive but yeah we just um, you know the meetings are cut a little bit short. Um, so yeah so breakfast so the agenda for today is meeting then breakfast um, and then after that I'll probably head into town to the gym um, and today's supposed to be a rest day, but I've been sitting at home literally doing work, editing, things like that. Um, then after the gym, come back here doing some edit, uh, edits, uh, and, and stuff like that. Um, kind of get back on my feet as far as content. Um, I'm still kind of iffy about shooting in the gym. Um, I'm still not there yet, but I'll do my best, um, if anything, yeah, so, yeah, but anyways, if I go to the gym today, it is a push workout, I'm also looking to getting a, uh, bicycle, kind of, you know, get some, get some cardio first thing in the morning, it, it's beautiful out here, great weather, uh, great scenery, not in the city, so that's pretty nice, there's a little trail right, right up here. Um, so I'll probably get a, I'm looking into getting a bike, so I might actually go to the store, take a look at those, and see what they have to offer. Other than that, um, I'll probably check in with you for breakfast, kind of show you what I'm eating, and, uh, yeah. What's going on, everyone? Checking back in. I need to fix this stand. Alright, so... I just came back from the gym. I didn't capture any content. Um, it was a push workout. And uh, I'm, now I guess I'm checking in with my post-workout meal. So I'm gonna teach y'all a little hack that I personally do. It's been working for me. Um, I used to do it, not anymore. So I used to stay in the kitchen 24 seven, cooking all my meals, blah, blah, blah. and. I just, over over time, consistency over time, didn't find that uh, time efficient. So what I've been doing is, so my post-workout meal is pretty much the same all the time, which is, uh, so what I do is I cook my chicken in bulk in the oven, and then after that, um, I'll use the air fryer to recook them so what I do usually the day prior is uh, make 14 ounces in one sitting and then I split this into two. Uh, two chicken and white rice meals. Um, and that usually, uh, that's, two, that's two meals out of the you know three to four that I eat. Um, high protein and it, uh, it helps with my, my macros, but I'm not really counting calories and macros right now. Um, I, I um, what was I saying? Um, I'm just eating, kind of getting good quality food in my system to see how my body reacts, things like that. Um, so yeah, so 
this is going to be split into two and then as far as the rice the hack right so the hack is i do white jasmine rice and then i make sushi uh vinegar i'll pour that in there so i'll again i'll cook enough for two meals and then after that put the uh the sushi vinegar in mix it up and then i'll either put um cilantro green onions or both i'm out of cilantro so i'll do green onion and uh and then i'll put spicy mayo all over fucking game changer um i know mayo is a uh, fat uh i really don't eat that much fat so i kind of like it helps out in a way um so yeah i'll show you the end product but it is So there's the finished product. Um, don't don't knock it till you try it. It is fire. Um, I uh, if if you want to try it, let me know. I'll drop my. <clears throat> Sorry, I had to clean a mess. Um, yeah, if you want to try it, which I think you should, let me know, and I'll drop the uh, the recipes down below. As far as like. Um, what how i make the chicken the sushi vinegar um the the sauce you name it um it i know it's not there's other healthier options but you know what matters most is can you be consistent with it um, i've eaten chicken and rice for years and i've gone through tons of phases tons of different kinds of chicken and rice and you know i i really enjoy this so give it a shot give it a try hit me up um instagram facebook but yeah i'm about to chat on on this meal enjoy some some, some tv and uh i'll probably check in with you guys either later or tomorrow i'm not too sure I'm trying to still figure out um you know where the content where, what type of content i'm gonna do Am I just going to do a bunch of day in the lives? I don't know. But yeah, 